Today we're doing, I have, I think it's Nicole and Azat, that's my best guess, I'm not sure whatsoever. Guys, remember, if you want to send anything in ever to have Miles wear, just send it in for mail date. P.O. Box is in the description below. Also, let's go, 500, 500 followers, we're getting there, we're getting real goddamn close, guys. I see you guys following, twitch.tv slash whiteboxpoppy, we're playing Dead by Daylight. <laughs> that was cool as fuck. Okay, that was all, okay. That that's that's going to your video. That felt pretty good. I'm not gonna lie to you. That felt good. It's mad fun. Okay, let's go. I think we only have like two or three parts left till we go on to the next episode. We're still on the first like new episode that came out like two weeks ago. That angle really does not do anything good for you. You look wide as fuck. I know you guys have been telling me, I mean a bunch of DMs have been seeing comments about how Hassan is not his real name. Why would they just blatantly show Hassan? Why would, if you guys were trying to like keep his name like a secret, why would you even show that plaque? What the fuck is going on here? By the way, that's way too many pictures of you and him. That's fucked up. Hey, May. Wake up. Uh... Today is Azin's interview for the K-1 visa, and I'm so excited. I wanted me and May to stay at my mom's house because I didn't want to oversleep. Okay. I can't wait to see him get denied, first of all. Second of all, you stay at your mom's house so you don't oversleep? What the fuck does that mean? Morning. Morning. You want some coffee? Sure. All right. That's just a weird interaction. Every time somebody interacts with their parent on this TV show, it's always so fucking weird. You want some coffee? Sure. It's 6.30 a.m. and Azen's interview is at 8 a.m. His interview is at what? 8 a.m.? Azen has to go to the Casablanca consulate for his interview, and there's basically like a stack of papers that he has to bring with him. Documents, pictures, Everything to prove our relationship. I'm so excited. That's the thumbnail. Wow, she looked atrocious. Especially, I love how she said the words, I'm so excited, but looked like she was on her deathbed. Wow, that is just, that's literally looking rough. I'm so tired too, though. But it's hard sleeping because I know that it, he's going to be going soon. And I'm nervous. Have you been drinking, Nicole? What the hell's going on? <laughs> what the fuck? How's he doing? Like, he's ready to move. He's ready to get to see what it's like here and to also see my culture and what I grow up with. I Why are you talking so slow? Are you having a stroke? Seriously, let us know if there's a problem. She, to my knowledge, is not ever talking. I mean, I get she's tired, guys. I get that. But I also just woke up. Yeah, yeah, okay, it's almost 2 p.m., whatever. Also, when I hear, he could see my culture. Yeah, okay, yeah, white people in America have culture, but like, like what though? Yeah, we wake up, my mom, yeah, we have coffee, uh, usually a McDonald's breakfast, Uber Eats. What, what, what are you gonna show him that he probably doesn't assume already? You guys overeat and you also eat dessert. That's gonna be interesting. It's gonna be so much fun. Okay, that might be the fun. <laughs> She looks like so high right now. Like she's, she looks like she's making fun of somebody who's high. I don't know that she does understand just how important this moment in her life is. This is going to shape her future. Everything from this point on is going to be completely different. Isn't that with like the overwhelming majority of choices you make in life? Like my whole entire life could change if I just threw him across the kitchen on camera. How does that sound, huh? You think you could fly? You want to try? You look very fed up. I think he's tired. What'd you do today? You sleep longer than I do. What do you want to do if he does get accepted? I mean, what's the plan? Well, hopefully when he gets accepted and he gets his visa, probably two weeks after that. Why are you slurring your words? What did she put in that coffee? How many little Bailey's cups did you put in that? He'll come. What if he comes all the way here? You put all this effort 
and all this work into getting him here, getting married. How are you going to feel if he leaves, Nicole? <sighs> that would be devastating. These are the exact same questions I would be asking my friend if they were bringing any, probably anybody from anywhere. If you're bringing somebody from Michigan to Chicago, I'd be like, what if they fucking leave you? Because they're going to leave you. Look at you. But I don't think about that. You don't think about that? You don't think of a possible scenario? Oh, we knew that, though. You know, I just I think sometimes you're pretty oblivious. I am worried that maybe his motives are not as pure as she thinks they are. I hope that when he does arrive, if he arrives, that he does put forth every effort to make a great relationship with her. And it will be work, but it's worth it. To who? To this channel. It's worth it to this channel. You're right. You got a good point. It's worth it to everybody. Somebody sent me like 20, a video on Instagram, like 20 facts about 90 Day Fiance. I don't really remember the overwhelming majority of it. I kind of watched it at 4 o'clock in the morning. But there was like an audio clip. Apparently, like, this dude, Hazan, cheats on her like crazy. Which, I don't, I don't blame him whatsoever. Also, there's like an audio recording of him talking to a girl asking for a kiss. He's like, yeah, kiss. Kiss real nice. Let me give more kiss. That's all the information I have for you at this moment, and I will not have any more further from this point. Y'all can talk about it if you want. I'm trying to imagine all the girls he has sex with and what they look like, and to me, they all look like her. So have you guys discussed what you're going to do if he doesn't? Of course not, because he's going to get his K-1 visa. Wow, you seem overly confident for what's about to not happen. I'm glad you're positive, but you're not in control of everything. There are <laughs> There's so many thumbnails that are possible. I might just use all of them. So when's he gonna call? I don't know. I can't take his phone, so... And I don't know how long the interview is. I think at least a few hours. Have you, has he texted you yet? <sighs> was that an answer? Was that a cough? Or was that a breath? What was that? What is going on here? Is this the real Nicole? Is the real Nicole coming out? The alcoholic with a 75 IQ? What happens if he pulls the same thing he pulled last time and he just doesn't call? He'll call. Once again, extremely confident. Where's that confidence coming from? I have no idea. Oh, probably from having men fuck her while she's dating another guy. All right. Wow, it's already over. Well, they actually, there wasn't actually two parts in that one. Or did I do that one really long? Or did that one feel long because she didn't speak one single actual word? Why was she talking in cursive? Kind of like a rag doll. Look at this. Floppy little stupid arms. Like a pony. This is now a parenting channel. Fuck you. I, I quite literally, on the timeline, I cannot tell who's up next because I see actually every single couple. Is the lax... Lax. Lax is the last six minutes I make fun of her talking and look what happens. That's karma. I don't believe in karma, but that was karma. Is the last six minutes just going to be just all of them. Just chopped up. And for everybody sending me the um, Danielle versus... Who was it? Enfisa? Danielle versus somebody. I think it was Danielle versus Enfisa clip that TLC posted. Guys, it's just old clips that they put up in one video of each person. With zero substance. It was a very misleading title. I too thought they were gonna fight. They should turn this TV show into a competition, like a fucking death match. Turn this into a coliseum. The last boss will be Danielle, okay? She gets to hit people with the spoon she stirred the ham in that uh, Mohammed cannot eat, but she also gets to pee on people, like projectile pee. This could be an awesome video game. Speaking of video games, roll that fucking Twitch clip, bitch! Mm -hmm. I wonder if he saw me between us. Oh! <laughs> oh my god! I hope you'll be here before half. Oh, Kill me on the hook. No, he didn't. Come on, come on. He's on me. I'm gonna heal you on the hook. Holy shit, chat! Holy fuck! 
Oh my god! Yo! Holy shit!